Hey guys, Jimmy here. Just want to talk to you a little bit about Saddleback Coffee Sleeves. Also, I have a couple homemade ones that I did. I'll show you guys in a minute. But, here's a couple different ones I have. We have the Saddleback. This is their script logo. Unlined coffee sleeve. And then we have the Love 41 unlined coffee sleeve this is a suela i believe leather so this is going to look great the more you use it pretty awesome i believe when i first got this it was pretty pale um, so it's already showing its age and i really don't use it and then we have the lined pigskin lined as you can see right there it's a pigskin lined script logo got blue on the background I believe this was their original coffee sleeve and then uh, then they came out with the online version this is a, a new logo one right here and this is what you can see by unlined so how do you get one? Oh, well, it's kinda difficult um, you can get them in a bundle like when the small water bag bundle came out, I think it was 2017, uh, it came with a key ring, luggage tag, and a coffee sleeve. Also the small briefcase, classic briefcase bundle came out with a coffee sleeve. I believe it also came with a wallet, a square wallet. You've seen one of those in my wallet videos. And also a key ring so that's kind of how you pretty much get them although I'm not sure but I think love 41 you can buy them off their site off the love 41 site but not the saddleback ones saddleback ones uh, the ones that I got are in bundles like this guy right here these ones these ones right here in the tobacco these came in a mystery box that I ordered um, this is the dark coffee brown version and this is also from the uh, the bundle from the small water bags so that's just a few that I've collected I started making my own this is one that I made my own got some leather and I lined it with pigskin myself and uh, try not to get in the shadow of the camera but anyways Lined it with pigskin myself, stitched it up. I've been using this one uh, in my truck. So this one's unlined, still stitched around. And instead of having the uh, leather go on top of each other and then stitch it down, I just measured it, cut it, and then poked holes on it. Anyways, if you're wondering about coffee sleeves, Here's kind of the different generations that they've had. Um, again, I don't, I don't think in the past that you could buy them, um, but they did come included with some bundles, either the small briefcase classic bundle, and then the small water bag bundle. But uh, thought I'd share with you guys because it's something you really kind of don't see that much. I don't think I've seen any, hardly any videos of them on YouTube about the saddleback or coffee sleeves in general, leather coffee sleeves in general. So short video, still pretty neat. Um, these are the different size on cups, so why I got you here. I kind of want to show you the difference on the sizes and what size cups they'll have. I don't apologize, I don't know the different terms Starbucks uses for their cups, so I just call it small, medium, large, and they usually correct me at Starbucks, and I say, yes, I may have a large. So, this is the lined one right here. I got it on the smallest one. Let's put it on a large one, and we can see the difference <clears throat> on how it'll fit. So, if you... <laughs> doesn't fit that well, does it? That's their large, so it goes around the bottom. So, that's going to be made for, if you like, the smaller cups. 
Uh, let's see what it looks like on a medium. You're pretty much there too. It's so if you like a shot of espresso or something like that, and then the small cups, and you want to have a coffee sleeve for it, and this will be the one to get because that holds pretty nice. If we look at the medium, the unlined one, that fits pretty good. That, that's about right. And then if we go for the large one, you're looking, it doesn't look as bad as the this guy did, but it's still pretty useful, usable. That's kind of how I have it, usually. I get drinks. That way I don't get the, the cardboard one. Also, <laughs> don't ask me how I know this, because I'm not going to tell you. But these are really easy to throw away with your cup. Just saying. So keep in mind when you using your any kind of a leather coffee sleeve, make sure you take it off before you toss it out. But uh, yeah, that looked pretty nice. That's the one I hand did, hand stitched. This is a suede pigskin on the inside, so it stays on the cup real nicely as well. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for your subscriptions and your likes. Thanks for your comments. Thank you.